Hi everyone, today's headlines. Manipur, woman killed in fresh violence. Eastern Sumis rally to merge with Junabato district. FNR urges Nagaland groups to desist from war of words. Council of Nagalim churches flays WC and NPG. Koima priest named the new bishop of Itanagar. News in details, Manipur, woman killed in fresh violence. In a fresh incident of violence on Thursday, one woman was killed and a fresh others were injured at Lemekong Harotil in Kangpokpi district, Manipur police said. A police official in Imphal said that armed militants carrying sophisticated weapons raided several villages in Kangpokpi district, open fired and assaulted people. A woman was killed on the spot at Lemekong village and several others were injured in the militants' firing. Paramilitary personnel accompanied by Manipur police have rushed to the villages and lodged combining operation to nab the extremists. Eastern Sumis rally to merge with Zunapato district. Thousands of people participated in a peace rally organized by the Eastern Sumi Hoho at Sayochung town in Kifri on Thursday demanding the merger of Eastern Sumi territory with Zunapato district in the event of Eastern district getting autonomous council status. They also demanded that their population census and electoral roll be included in the Zunapato district and not under autonomous council. FNR urges Naga groups to desist from war of words. Against the backdrop of the recent war of words between the Naga national political groups and NSCN IM, the Forum for Naga Reconciliation has called upon the Naga political groups, any individual or group to desist from using violent or extremist language. Today, the Forum for Naga Reconciliation makes this open call to the signatories of the Convenient of Reconciliation, Tuesday, June 13, 2023. Mark the 14th year of signing of the COR, which helped cease violence among different Naga political groups, FNR stated. Council of Nagalim Churches flays WC and NPG. The Council of Nagalim Churches has wondered if the Working Committee Naga National Political Groups has forgotten the agreement signed with the NSCN IM to work together for the resolution of the Naga political issue and to refrain from indulging in violence of words through print and on social media. It reminded that the two groups had signed a joint accord and a Naga relationship and cooperation in the presence of Oram for Naga Reconciliation committing to explore at the earliest realistic ways for Nagas to move forward on the basis of Naga historical and political rights. Koima priest named the new bishop of Itanagar. Reverend Father Idatatal Benny Varghese, a Catholic priest at Koima Diocese, has been nominated by Pope Francis to the head the Diocese of Itanagar in Arunachal Pradesh as its second bishop. The first bishop of Itanagar Diocese, who retired from office on attainment of 75 years as per canon law, an update from the Koima Diocese stated that the announcement was made at the Vatican on Thursday. It has described Father Benny as the versatile priest who hails from Kerala. After his schooling, his ardent desire to be a missionary of Christ brought him to Nagaland in 1986. The statement read adding after his studies and formation for priesthood in various institutions in Nagaland and Northeast. He was ordained a priest at Koima Diocese on April 19, 1999. That's all for now. To get the status, don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you.